There's no death for the soul. Death is not the end of the life. It's a new beginning of life. In spiritual science is that there is no death. Death is a laughable affair. Death is only the conclusion of one episode. A soul has got many, many births, Abha, not only one birth. A soul knows about all the births. When you know about all the births, there is no birth at all. Then there is no death at all for the soul. Soul lives in soul consciousness. When you understand truth, you know about death. You experience death. A great friend is gone away from the life, physically, so it is difficult to fill that void. Any meditator would have come out of the body in his meditation. Then we will realize that we are not the body, we are something else. If you had an experience, then you don't fear death, first of all. It is a change of, as we change the class, we move from one body to another body. And life is a continuous journey, and death is only a come. While well, I fully understand the concept and I fully live that concept of energy and consciousness and then I'm connected with Him. We are here in this human body, physical touch and feel is there and Patrizi had such a massive presence. Always he said that the role is the artist in this earth. How do whatever the performance of your humanity goes towards society that is the identification of you when you are living this physical world. And what the legacy is that he left is meditate, get other people to meditate, be a vegetarian, and share the message of becoming a vegetarian with others. And that I will do and will always do. And live in the assumption of being in the Buddhahood that you want to be. Be the enlightened being that you want to aspire to and be it now. And I adore the luminosity that he aspired and gave his entire life to. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Patriji. I have to admit, I am in deep mourning in my heart, but I also see the light of the continuation of the soul. So I am grateful. Thank you, thank you, thank you for having had me as part of the PSSM movement. I still feel him around me. He is always there. And he's going to be still there with us through his concepts, through his way of life, how he lived his life, and how well he utilized his physical body to take this mission forward. So I think uh, through that, we can still uh, feel his presence, and he will be with us through all the concepts he has shared for 30, 40 years he is with us. Patrigy has withdrawn his essence from his form. Obviously, his contract is complete. I would have loved to have been able to talk to him and maybe I will be able to in meditation and um, just see what his plans are now that he's free from this form. It was time, perfect time. So wonderful to celebrate. Having met him, wonderful to celebrate um, the times we've shared together and that he did extend and descend into this form and, and be, was on earth for the time that he was here. So biggest hugs to you all. I know we'll all miss him because that's what happens when somebody does complete and leave. We are all like, oh, but I won't get to see him anymore or hug him or cuddle him, even though we understand the bigger picture. So thank you, thank you, thank you. Sir has already gave us the knowledge of death. It's nothing but leaving your old clothes and getting into new clothes. So that is what he has taught us since many years. And we have to take it in such a way that death is a celebration. His main teaching is that 
so as a permanent master as we know everything we have to accept it make sure that he is happy his vision is very clear he has the all the guiding principles yes one day mahasamadhi happened now in the process of taking his mission Wherever you are talking about here, Rana Pana Sati, immediately the brand name is Kam Patri Ji. So how much we have to sell you, team? Is living God, is walking God, is our Duta, is everything here? I pray, Patri Ji. to give all of you a succession of successive successes sarve jana sukhino bhavantu sarve permit masters sukhino bhavantu